Blank name is yeah. asking a very interesting question. And it kind of ties into a question they asked earlier, which I might tie into this. But um, he's asking, I tried really hard to look into feminist scholarly work, but I don't understand their point. What is part, what part of sexualization is wrong? Especially considering if it is an expression, like many other forms of expression. Do feminists, I don't think all feminists think sexualization is wrong. Many no, feminists, but there are many who strongly do. Many, many, many. Okay, but but let's not act like this is the position of feminism. There are many positions of feminism that are actually defending, uh, defending it. Right? I, I think, would, like I most, think... most 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 like new most feminists right now that we hear of, uh, not only defend sexualization, they defend sex workers. Like you know so they are like in favor of sex work sex workers sex worker rights um sex workers rec be reckon being respected being recognized as real workers um so we can't act like feminists are against sexualization as a whole but yeah go on you were saying something um i think it comes down to sexualization being imposed on someone that's um a big part of it so and i mean that can mean so many different things so on an interpersonal level it could be someone objectifying and sexualizing someone who isn't interested in them or that in general or you could talk about how women, young women in particular, like maybe you could argue through um, social means are coerced into sexualizing themselves for the social um, incentives um, that come yeah. in many different forms. Um, so I, a lot but those of people are justified. have a critique of that. But those, yeah, but those are justified to be against those things. Like, I think, like, these are not contradictions. You could be completely in favor of sexualizing people who want to be sexualized or and completely against the sexual. And also sometimes the same people. Sometimes some people are like, I want to be sexualized now and not now. You know what I mean? And like, so I think mm. like you understand that if somebody is enjoying sexual, being sexual or being appreciated as a sexual being and wanting to be complimented or treated like a sexual, um, you know, appreciated that way. And at this moment, and then maybe, I, you know, and nobody should be against that. You know what I mean? Nobody would like, yeah, I want to be sexy right now. I be, 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 want to be noticed as sexy. And I want to be appreciated as sexy, and I want to, I, I want that attention. That should be welcome. And then maybe the next day, at the, or the next hour, we're like, okay, now I don't, now I don't. Um, so we could be completely in favor of that form of sexualization when it's being welcomed, and also being against sexualization when it's not being welcomed, like when mm -hmm. somebody is not appreciating that. Like the same, like for example, let's say you're going, it's the same woman going into. Um, I don't know, a kink party, right? And she's wearing her sexiest outfit and is appreciating being recognized as sexy and her outfits and everything. And she wants to be like, I don't know, even uh, be dominated by somebody. She's welcoming that. She's open about that. She's giving a green light about that, right? So in that situation, you should that is that should be celebrated. Like you, you do you and you enjoy that, right? But then let's say like the next day she's at her office Right, and she's giving a PowerPoint presentation, and you know, and then people are sexualizing her at that moment, and she's not appreciating mm -hmm. that. Like we could look down upon them, we're like, okay, that is that is not you should not be sexualizing her right now. This is not welcome. Like I think we could say, like you don't have to be completely against it or for it. It depends on the context, and it depends if it's being welcomed or not being welcomed. Yeah, I completely agree. I wasn't trying to argue either way. I was trying to explain like what some views of it are. Um, in terms of like what part of it is wrong if it's an expression. Um, so on top of what is the stuff I said before, like it um, 
also comes down to how much is this your own self-expression and then how much of this is um, an attitude that someone else or society has towards you. Meaning like, do they um, uh, like value you only for your sexual utility to them? Like, um, and have a complete disregard for your safety and well-being otherwise. Like, obviously that's wrong. That's um, not one's own self-expression. You know, I think the answer to all of these things is just like, are you making people and yourself happier or are you doing something that they don't welcome? And they, like, it, the solution to all of this is like, don't be a dick have fun while making other people also have fun it's just as simple as that like usually the answer to most of what is right and what is wrong is just like don't have fun at the expense of others try to make them also enjoy enjoy their lives like is that it's just that simple <laughs> yeah what's the harm being done hey guys if you're a fan of blasphemy and sexy cali you know like me, then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter, link in the description below. Because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today. And we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week. So make sure to subscribe, link in the description below.